All right, so name of this game is My Plate Pin Knockdown. Here's a setup on this team. They got a row of 15 pins in the retrieving section. This section over here also has a throwing section. This is the only place students can throw the ball from, in front of the hula hoop to the net. Over here on this side, they also have a throwing section from hula hoop to the net. This is where they throw. And then if a ball is loose, they come back here and they get the ball. Object of the game is to throw the ball over the net, knock down a pin. If you knock down a pin, we're working on our aiming, our looking, our uh, visual tracking. When a pin gets knocked down, the other team comes around, collects their winnings, they set up their pin. He must have knocked down one, she must have knocked down one. They set up the pins, they come over, now they're going to grab a food card. Out of the pool are cards of food, representing what we eat in a day. They grab a food card and they bring it over to their plate. At the end of the class, we're going to see of all the foods we've eaten, how many actual complete my plates were we able to form. If they're still, they'll be surprised. They'll have more of one item and less of another item and not have complete food plates, which is very reminiscent of a daily, uh, what we actually eat. Sometimes we eat more meat than we do grain. Sometimes we don't eat enough vegetables or fruit or dairy. So this is my plate 10 knockdown. It really isn't a winner or a loser. This is working on aiming, developing our tracking with our eyes, our throwing. Hey, knock down a pin! So they're running around. They're coming around the other side. They're the ones who knocked them down. So they will set up the pins. Go ahead and set up that one other. I think you got two. And then after they set them up, they run over and get a food card. And they take the food cards over to their my plate. She must have just gotten one or two. And then they grab one for every pin they knock down and they put it into their my plate. All right, so we just finished the game of my plate pin knockdown. Now what they're doing is they're sorting out the different food groups. Vegetable, fruit, dairy, grain, protein. After they sort them out, then they're gonna create my plates. They're gonna put one fruit, one vegetable, one grain, one protein, one dairy in a group. And then they're gonna do it, see how many completed my plates they can make. The interesting thing they're gonna find out, it's very similar to all of our diets, we end up eating more from one food group than we do from the others. So we're gonna have 12 berries, but only two vegetables. So we may only be able to complete, of all the foods, only two my plates. We'll see what they come up with. All right, so this side, how many completed my plates did you end up with? Two. Because you only had two of which one? But which, which food did you have the most of? This side, how many completed my plates do you all have? Three. Three. Which food did you end up with the most of? A lot of dairy, but only three completed my plates? All right, good job. Name of this game is My Plate Pin Knockdown. It really works a lot with nutrition, my plate, and food groups. Hope you like this video. Hope it works well with your students. If you like this video, please subscribe to our YouTube channel, R-H-E-P-E, -E, where you can find other wonderful videos for your physical education program. Have a great school year.